Hey what's up guys, in this video I will be showing you how to install the Cyanogen Mod 12 based on the Android 5.0 that is the Lollipop on your Galaxy S4 i9-500. So this is for the Exynos Octa-Core variant, this is not the final version of the CM12 but this tutorial will work with the future releases of this ROM as well. You must be rooted and should have a custom recovery installed in order to install this ROM. If you don't know how to do that, check the description and make sure to back up everything important cause you'll be losing all your apps and data. Now hit link 1 from the description that will take you to this page, download the ROM and the G apps, then transfer it to your phone. Once done, turn off your device. Once the device is off, hold the volume up, power and the home button at the same time until you see the Galaxy S4 displayed. So this will take us to the recovery mode. Once you are on the recovery mode, First go to wipe data slash factory reset and hit yes. So guys you can use your volume keys to navigate and power button to select on the recovery mode. Ok that's done. Go to wipe cache partition and hit yes. Now go to advanced and wipe Dalvik cache. Now go back, go to mountain storage and here you need to format system. So this is very necessary for a clean installation. Once done, now go back, go to install zip, choose zip from SD card if the ROM is in the internal memory, else choose zip from SD card if it's on your external. So select the ROM file, the CM12 for i9500 and hit yes. So this will take few minutes. Ok that's done. Now again, go back to the same folder and this time you need to install the G apps. So this is the Google apps for Android 5.0 Lollipop. Once this is done, go back and hit reboot system now. If you get this prompt, hit yes, fix root. The first boot will take some time, just be patient and I will be back with you guys once we boot back. So guys we have successfully installed the CM12 ROM on the Galaxy S4. So let me just skip the basic setup. So as you can see we have the lollipop icons, app drawer animations, you also have the SMS app but you can always switch to hangouts for your default SMS app. Now quickly going on to settings, about device and as you can see we are running the Android 5.0 lollipop. So that's all for this video guys, this is not the final version of this ROM, there are few bugs but within few days with the new updates everything will be fixed. Again I would like to say that this method will work with the future builds as well. So thank you guys for watching, I will be coming out with the review once we have the final version, so stay tuned and you guys have a great time.